What is up? Welcome to today's video. Danny here, coming for you from Singapore. Well, you obviously know the Singapore series is going on right now. It's day three, and we're gonna be moving. We're gonna be moving from Clark Key closer to Chinatown. So for today, moving hotels. We want to get into the Marina Bay Sands area. Obviously, for us, this is an iconic like close to heart place so we're gonna be here for four days in total this is day number three so we need to make sure to get there so for today's video you can expect some Marina Bay Sands views maybe we're gonna go to the Arts and Science Museum some food but for now we're still in the hotel let's get a hotel breakfast maybe let's jump into the pool and then let's get out of here sitting here at the breakfast and what I think is always cool when they have like not just like the standard stuff like scrambled eggs and potatoes this kind of like the American breakfast that I have going on here but actually like some local cuisine I think this is more Indian as far as I got so I got some rice with chicken and these noodles back there and fruits is always the key to a good breakfast in a hotel Judy's rocking German breakfast aren't you <laughs> She's preparing to come home. <laughs> All right, catch you in the pool. So I'm still young, looking in the mirror. Still trying to be the best of my era. Might get a bit tipsy. Might mix a cold cup with a whiskey. Your lower body is huge, massive. I'm a spend my money, can't get enough, so sweet like honey. Tonight I'm spending my cash, and never look back, no never. Alright, so basically I'm trying to get down and Judy has the room key, so I'm trying to call her right now basically. And I wanted to take the staircase and now I'm locked out. Safe place. Definitely a pretty safe place. She's in the shower room probably. God. Alright, so I'm basically stuck here on the roof now. I can go up to the roof and our room. Is down there. I wrote Judy a message and what we're doing right now is we're waiting for her to react and we're just one floor below that so let's see actually it's already checkout time so let's see when she's gonna get the message okay so I think the problem is solved I got a tip from one of the guys who was working here we have a staff elevator let's see if this is gonna help Yay! We're going home! What have you been doing? You didn't get my messages? No. Well, check your phone. What? Check your phone and read it. My Wi-Fi is Just read your messages. Not loading? Well, basically, I've been stuck at the uh, rooftop because they didn't have a card <laughs> Shit, I'm for the sorry. past ten minutes. Yeah. Sorry. No, well, no worries. We got a story for the video. This is the hair product I'm using, and I just got this stuff in Australia. The name of it is Bad Gear. Definitely the best hair product that I had yet, so I can recommend it 100%. I have no idea who this company is and if they're like global or anything but this is the only stuff that I can God, that I can put into my hair and it stays in place so thinking about cutting the hair soon but at the moment I don't know I just let it grow boom then you don't even see that it's that long I mean that's how I usually look and this is also how long it takes, just boom. These have definitely been a few nice days at this place. And now it's time for the next location here in Singapore. And it's just down the road. You coming? Let's get there. Let's go. Let's go. We got a law-abiding citizen there. 
And this week there's gonna be the place that we're gonna be checking in right now. I'm really excited for it. I remember last year, first time in Singapore, we've been walking by it and thinking what this place is. All right, we gotta get going. Don't wanna miss the green light. And now we get a chance to actually stay there. Okay, moved into the new place, was easy and smooth, and as you see, this is pretty mind-blowing. This is amazing, it's probably one of the nicest rooms, just from the interior and from the style of it, it's quite modern, and I like that a lot. But before we're gonna jump into kind of like a room tour, maybe even a hotel tour, because it's a very unique setup of the hotel, you have a lot of greenery on it, and um, just one thing, I, want just, I just want to get one thing out of the way. We're not paying for this place. Both of our stays, uh, the last one and this one, have been sponsored as well as the last time we have been in Singapore. So all these luxury hotels, this is a five-star hotel, I believe, and we're not paying for them. We just, uh, we just got the opportunity to stay here uh, in actually different arrangements. And um, yeah, just making a video about it, enjoying the process. And this video is just like for the one side, just to see how like a luxury hotel in Singapore is going to be uh, might look like. And I know that some people who are watching might have the funds to actually afford these type of places. So for you, it's just kind of like a look into it. And because I cover hotels so much in just the last three months, uh, we have been reaching out to a few hotels personally. And I think at this point we got three gigs. So three collaborations where I cover it in videos and um, once even a hotel reached out to us because they said to me, hey, I've seen the room tour from this place and from that place, why don't you come by and stop at our place? This was in uh, Bali just a few days ago, which was really cool. So I'm slowly setting up this format of actually like going to places and uh, sharing with the experience basically so i'm just saying that so you don't get it wrong i'm not trying to i don't know to brag or to paint a picture of how cool we are we are just filming drinks i'm gonna go to the bar gonna like ask for the dom perion just to film it uh, the thing is like right after we're gonna walk out of this place we're not gonna we're gonna be exploring like raw we're gonna go to a food court we're gonna mm, what are you laughing at there Right next to us is the uh, bun. Yeah, yeah, right next to us is our bun, uh, bun supply, supplier <laughs> for like a dollar or something. So I don't want to paint a picture of a situation that I'm not in. So we're getting the chance to stay at those beautiful places and I appreciate that. I enjoy it. But uh, I'm going to be 100% honest with you. It's This does not only make a great experience. This can add to it, but I see a lot of like not happy faces in these great hotels and accommodations but it is also a different thing to talk about because here you definitely do see a happy face and this is the place let me give you a quick room tour so I have a huge working desk we're gonna be staying at this place for two days Okay, so got out of the room here, and what is pretty cool is like, yeah, Judy was just saying, it has kind of like a beach housey vibe because it's an open space, and here it's real loud, but in a room it's completely quiet, and here they have the uh, separate room, so really, if this would be kind of like the ocean, I think this would fit, I don't know, would make more sense, but overall, really beautiful hotel. And now we're gonna jump, go to this floor five. And on floor five, there's supposed to be the pool and the gym. We're just gonna check it out for tomorrow morning. Okay guys, we just got to the fifth floor and I was just like, I need to change my lenses to my vlogging lens because I need to share some emotions real quick. So this is the place, it's definitely nice, nice pool, beautiful view, but the best thing, the gym. Let's go in. Let's go in. Sick. They have a fully equipped gym. I already see a dumbbells, cable, rows, machines. God. Oh, this is what I live for. I know I'm creeping around, but this is just awesome. We got a chest press, shoulder press. Was that app machine? Yes. Legs, leg curl. We're looking at a lat pull down. This is what Judy's saying is they don't have a barbell. I really don't 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 get it. Why? Why they don't go all the way? Oh, she found apples. 
Let's get him the vitamins. All right, so it's gonna be our home for tomorrow morning. Well, this is the view. Absolutely amazing. Nothing more I can say. Come. Okay, and this is how this place looks from outside, which I would say is the coolest thing about it. So there's a lot of greenery to it. That's the place. And uh, yeah, for now we're out here with the 2 p.m. right now, 2.30. So the plan is uh, for the rest of today's video, we're just gonna hang around a little bit from of the from the Marina Bay Sands area. Uh, right now we're here in the business district and I really like that. I really like the big buildings, the action when things are going on. And uh, I think it's not really kind of like a tourist area. And some, sometimes I get the suggestions of, hey Danny, check out more like of the residential areas. And we did that. Actually, once we stayed, very residential. We have been in a gym. I have to look it up on the map, but it's, it was very far on the left of Singapore. Yeah. What? Yeah. yeah, I think, where was it on the right? Was it close to the airport? Right. Yeah, close to Yes, it was very close to the airport. So the thing is why I love Singapore so much is just the big city vibe. Big buildings, seeing pe people being busy, going about the day. Here obviously you see a lot of businessmen, a lot of... And I think we're just like 10 minutes away from the MBS, from the Marina Bay area. And from there, this is going to be already the next video, we're going to head out to... Haji Lane, get some food and for tonight we have an arrangement for seafood. We're gonna try chili crab for the first time, but first let's get to the Maria Bay. I'm still young looking in the mirror Still trying to be the best of my era Might get a bit tipsy Might mix a cold talk with a whiskey I'ma spend all my money Okay, so we made it here Marina Bay Sands, this is the Merlion Last time we've been here We called it Merlion Because she thought we were in France And what can I say, it's as busy as last It's probably the most touristy spot But if you're just gonna be hanging out here I'm gonna be the only one and that is going to be pretty much it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed the few hotel tours. Right now it's 3 p.m. We're going to start out the next part of today. We're going to get something to eat. And tonight we're going to go out to actually quite a big seafood restaurant. And uh, Haji Lane is next up, right? So that's what you're going to see in the next video. Until then, well, you got a world to see. Oh, what is up? Welcome. Well, <laughs> this was a high-pitched voice. <laughs> Here's some stuff for the outro.